Oh, I guess I'm started the record already. This fucking YouTube thing. Anyway, listen. This is going to be a quick one. I want to address about the media. And by media, I mean all your news outlets, whether it's tabloid or otherwise, TMZ, CNN, Fox News, ABC, NBC, Us Weekly, whatever the fuck it is, Time Life, whatever. Uh, there's a problem with the news that's being reported. And, and I'm not going in the direction of how they lie and spin shit and all that. It's not that about that at all. And I, I might say a couple things here that might piss a couple people off. I expect that. So if it does, it does. If it doesn't, it doesn't. Whatever. No apologies, though, all right? I'm not, I'm not trying to offend you, so I don't have to apologize. That's not my intention. Know that right from the get-go. Anyway, this is the thing, all right? First of all, TMZ and shit like that with the bullshit they report, right? They talk about these people coming out of the closet that are gay. I don't understand why this is newsworthy, first of all. Second of all, it's almost always someone that it's like so obvious that they're gay or a lesbian, whatever. Like they, they, they just reported this kid from the, the Mean Girls movie, you know, the one, the tall fella. Like it was a shock that he was fucking gay. Really? Really? Why don't you report Dave Chappelle as a black man next? Seriously, I, I, cause I, I can't tell. Is he black? Is Dave Chappelle black? Another thing is, and, and this is the thing that really gets me, and it, it, it just happened recently on the news. And this is more of your general news, CNNs and your ABCs and all that shit. And, and again, I can't stress enough that I'm not trying to disrespect anyone with what I'm about to say. Okay? But I'm not going to apologize. This is my opinion, my view. But I'm not intentionally trying to shit on people if, if it comes off that way. But last week or whatever, I'm watching television. And all of a sudden, fucking special report comes on, remembering the Boston bombing. First of all, if you were there, or I had someone in this, uh, you know, running the marathon or viewing it, or from that area, or if you were just a person watching TV at all last year around this time, you're well aware of the Boston bombings and the tragedy that it that it was. We don't need a constant reminder of these tragedies. I, I don't know if it happens in other countries, so I can't speak for foreign lands. But in this country, we're stuck on shit that makes people sad. Like, we always want to feed the fear, feed the sadness in the morning. You know, there's people who don't want to see that because it reopens the fucking wounds. Every fucking year now, 9-11 comes, we got to see the Twin Towers get bombed and co collapse with the fucking planes. Like, how many fucking, you don't do this for Pearl Harbor, but yeah, we have a day for it. But I mean, you don't, you don't show the bombing of Pearl Harbor every fucking, the Holocaust, slavery, you know, these are things that happen too. Why, why don't we just have fucking every day, you know, oh, you know, it was the, this day so many years ago, so-and-so was a slave and he got his ass beat. You know, remembering Rodney King Day, remembering Martin Luther King getting his hedge fucking shot off, JFK getting his, they do that one too, I see fucking reminders, uh, JFK, Elvis Presley, John Lennon, I mean, why do we gotta remember all this fucking morbid shit, like, why do you gotta feed it to us, like, we know, we're smart, we've been there, we were here, we remember, fucking 9-11's in the history books in schools now, if they didn't know, they know now. Like, it, it, it's common knowledge. We don't need to rehash the fucking episodes. You know, we don't need to fucking celebrate. It, 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 I know it's not a celebration, but it, it, it comes off that way to me. It's like they're glorifying this tragedy every fucking year when they, they do these things. You know, you, you, you fucking want to commemorate it. You make a fucking day off. Take a day off. The government closes. All the businesses close. Including fucking stores, everything. Like, close down, 9-11, Observance Day. Whatever. You know, you make it Patriots Day. What the fuck's patriotic about that day? 
Anyway, that's about it. That's all I have to say. Stop reporting retarded shit about gay people coming out of the closet and this one having a fucking baby, this one's getting a divorce, this one's this, this one's that, and please, by all fucking means, stop telling us when these tragedies have happened a year ago, two years ago, ten years ago. We know we were there. They even did it with the space shuttle. That shit happened when I was a little kid. When the fucking space shuttle blew up, that, I was a little kid when they did that. That's the fucking the anniversary of. It's got to stop. Okay? Again, no disrespect, but it, it, it's got to stop. Stop fucking feeding people fear and feeding them sadness. And stop trying to keep your own fucking people down, United States. All right? This country's fucked up. It's fucked up, people. I'm being straight with you. It's fucked up. And if you watch the fucking news, it's the reason why it keeps getting reporting. It's not just fucking little kids dying and crime and all that. You allow all this shit to keep being watched and watched and watched. Read the fucking newspaper. Fuck the news outlets. Don't watch TV. Don't watch the news shows. Let their ratings plummet. Take a stand. Let's go back to old school journalism in papers, newspapers, shit like that. Read about it on the internet. But fuck the news. There's too much fucking news on TV. I got 50 news channels. Why do I need them all? Why? That's it. I'll talk to you soon.